Welcome back to A Little on the Left, a game where you're given random objects and have to figure out their rules. Usually the rules are figure out the most satisfying way to set up the objects. So I got a bunch of slanted paintings, pictures, I could possibly set them upright. Although look at this, when I tilt the picture, the beach ball moves. Oh, did it fall to the next frame over? Okay, hold on, new idea. You have to figure out how to get the ball into the hole. Can I get the tire into the hole? No, it becomes a donut over here. Okay, hold on. What if I tilt it this way? Does it become in the hole? Nice. Oh, now an apple is falling. Okay, well, how about I tilt it down to the golf course? Maybe, yeah, knock it into the hole there. Hole in one. Swish for basketball. Swish <laughs> to come through the star. And what was that? A sugar cube in the tea? Very satisfying. I now have a clock and flowers. And if I wind the time, I travel. What do I maybe want to line the shadows up with? Oh, I can have it go faster by the hour. Whee! All right, I'm like three days older now. Huh? I don't get it. Wait, nearby here, there are shadows that line up on the clock face and I can put it directly over. Is that the case for any other time? No, that is the only time I can have the hands overlap the shadows. So that's the solution. Got a bunch of chess pieces. I could arrange them in order of importance. King is the most important, then the queen, then the rook, then the bishop, the knight, then pawn. Then the knight, then bishop, then pawn. Why do they have different shadows? Oh, you can just adjust the shadows in the back. All right, well, hold on. Let me make sure every piece has its own matching shadow. Yeah, swap the queen and the bishop. Got to get the pawn over here. Swap the rook and the pawn. And then maybe you could just go from tallest to shortest. Oh, that's the only solution. It's just multiple things at once. Nighttime constellations. Oh, what the? I can take the stars and drag them. Oh, I make new constellations. Oh, it's all coming together. I wonder what it's going to be. It goes out here. It's starting to look maybe like a fish. And it's gone. That one falls into place. Oh, it wants to go over here somewhere. Follow the fuzz. There we go. It's going to be a long connection at some point, like here. Maybe something to connect more over here. Right there. Still a lot that needs to be connected. What animal is this? Oh, I saw something out here. Maybe a cat. This seem pretty cat-like. Well, I gotta think about where a cat would need to expand out there. It's cat-ish. Some other feline. Oh, there's a lot of spots where this could go. Well, here's one. I saw there was another over here. There's probably another over here. Still can't tell what it is. It's like some sort of castle or something. Maybe something with scales? Whoa, long connection. Maybe something that's curled up and has like a lot of feet. Oh, maybe see the edge still. Like this is its head and it's kind of curled up. I got four legs and possibly a tail. Come on. Yeah, feels like something on the inside. Oh, maybe another. Oh, maybe it's just another cat. Maybe they were all cats. Uh oh, time's ticking down. I didn't lose, did I? Oh, I can flip it. Does everything have to be in motion? Oh, I see, I see, there's desktop icons that probably have to match their real life equivalents like this. Oh, and I bet they have to match their arrangement in the room. It's almost recursive. So I got a computer in the bottom middle. I got a globe to the left of it. I got the hourglass to the right of it. Sticky notes gotta be assembled. It could go here. I mean, that works. Have it in place over there. Oh, cat. No! Get rid of the viruses. I have an apple with the stem to the left, so that's got to be all the way in the bottom. Paintbrush probably goes in the jar. Keys go on the hanger. In this order, it looks like. Paintbrush goes in the jar. Oh, this is a clock. So that goes top middle. Paintbrush goes in the jar. The clock has to match time which looks like this about. Try the hourglass again. No? What am I missing? Oh, 
On the paint palette, it has three colors in order. Red on the left, blue in the middle, tan on the right. There. Everything's right. <laughs> the paint! Got a bunch of matchboxes. Do I have to strike, strike the match to see which goes in which? Or do I maybe just put one in each? What the? Why did that happen? Okay, so there's like an input and an output for these matches. Sometimes their colors get changed. So I put in a match in yellow, and then it comes out in orange, so it just rotated clockwise once? Does it have anything to do with what color the match in the center is? I don't think so, but I got one of every color. Now what? Maybe I put them all in the middle? What? What the? Oh, nice. Rainbow flame. Oh, what is going on here? It's a mirror. Oh, I see. So I have to have the objects match their place in the mirror. A lot of strange stuff here. It's like I gotta take this lemon out and put this lemon in. Put that about there. Drag it over. Bring the vase over. Put the flower in the vase. It's about right. Actually, speaking of lemon, it probably goes in the pitcher. I have to put out the candle. It's annoying because I can tell from the mirror there's a latch on the other side, but I can't get to the other side of the box. That's like... I have to open it in the mirror! You grab the inside of the mirror, that's how you open the box. Eat my ass. There's a light with some birds. It's a cute little clock. Oh, I can adjust the lights. Whoa. What do I do with these? Do I want them on or off? Let's do it on. See what happens. Use a ton of power. It'll probably shut off the lamp. Is that the idea? How? Oh. Oh, I gotta make a heart, probably. I can kind of see where it is. I gotta turn off a lot of the outsiders and turn off the top left corner. And it looks like a heart, just like the birds. Now that's cute. It's a cat. Cat eyes. Oh. Whoa. Majestic cat timing. Ah, the timing of the pet. It's a rhythm game. Pet when the circles fill the circles. The perfect cat petting rhythm. Beautiful. I don't control any of this. Wait, I do have a mouse. Oh, a kaleidoscope. What can I do? I can rotate them. Ho 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 ho! You are under my spell. Wait, that's it? Rotate the pencils? Nice! Oh, it's gotten trippy now. All right, just rotate the stuff. That's the puzzle. Can I do more than just rotate? Oh, I can take these mice. I don't know what to do with them exactly. Ah, just complete the rotation. Interesting. And now the post-it notes. Okay, I got to rotate it so it becomes a consecutive touching thing. It's all connected. One line. Got the cans of tuna. Probably gotta make it so they're all the same color. Like that. The egg. Rapid fire. Maybe have them all be on screen. Oh, expand the forks. And then the eggs. I mean, that looks pretty good. Oh, there's strawberries too. Oh, I can rotate them. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, have them in between the eggs like that. I don't know what else, what else you can do with the eggs. And the strawberries. Oh, away. It's just the revenge tour of all the classic things. The screws and washers. You have them all pointed in. All pointed in. And bring this one to create a hexagon. We got chess pieces. Ah, I gotta rotate so the shadows fit. Shadow fits the rooks. Shadows fit the knights. Shadows fit the pawns. And bring in... Oh, I can bring in all their shadows. Ah. And the rotating food container. Well, you could stack them in order of size. There we go. It's getting bigger. 
is getting huge. A beautiful rainbow. It gets even bigger. How big are these food trays? I have never seen food trays of this monster proportion. It still gets bigger. They're becoming the size of a house. Oh, that's a little bigger. It's a little bigger. It's a little bigger. It's a little bigger. It's giant. It still goes out. It's consuming the entire neighborhood. Bring on the other ones. They all have to fit somehow. Don't know how yet, but that's what I'm here to figure out. That stands up and these fit in as well. Fruit the size of a city. It's cloudy with a chance of spaghetti up in here. Cloudy with a chance of meatballs, whatever. Alternate the asparagus. Fit the tomato. Actually, there's two tomatoes. We could put those together. We put the carrots side by side. By side. You have the lemon. You got the cherries. You have the olives. All fitting in there. And then you'll lose the crumbs. Actually, maybe those go with the sandwich. Nice. And further out. Big trays. Space trays. Possibly the size of planets. Ah! No! What the? Nothing fits. It's not satisfying at all. Oh, giant Tupperware falling from the sky. Those were the lids. What the? Do I gotta stack it? Like grab a gray one? Okay, stack the gray one. Stack that one. Is this like a speed challenge or something? I don't know. Just keep stacking right now. Stack them high. Stack them mighty. I can't believe I dropped that. What do you do? Don't stop stacking yellows. Oh, hold on. A little switch here. Take that. No. Ah. No, 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 no. No, I don't want that. I want this here. There we go. Sorry. No, no, no. Stop that. Put it over here. Put it here. Put it in. It goes up. 75 years later. I don't get it. What's the end game? Are there any yellows left? Yeah, one more yellow. Wait, wait, hold on. Get rid of this one. Stack it to the very top. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm at the moon. Finally. <laughs> oh, the yin and yang moon. The silhouette of the cat. All the constellations. I bet that's the next puzzle. Cat constellations? If there is one. Whoa. Whoa. That's a big cat eye. Did I beat it? What the? I'm here again. Hey, there we go. <laughs> well, that was a sweet game. Can I ruin all the... <laughs> yeah, I can ruin all the puzzles. To help me get through the credits. A short but sweet experience. Some lovely puzzles in this one. Some very satisfying creations. But keep an eye out for more satisfying puzzle games. And just stay tuned for more puzzle games in general. If you like puzzle games, I've got a trillion of them on my channel. If you want to see what puzzle games I've played, check out my playlist of playlists. It's the first episode of every playlist I have on my channel. If you like the first episode, then you definitely like the full series. And with that, I'll see you on the next time. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a wonderful day and peace.